Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel Tech and Tips with King. In this video, I am going to show how you can run Windows 10 64 bit in your Android with using Limbo PC Emulator. So, without any wasting of time, let's get into the video. In this video, I am going to show how you can run Windows 10 64 bit in your Android with using Limbo PC Emulator. So, in this video, I am going to show how you can run Windows 10. So, in my previous video, uh, I have shown how you can run Windows. Uh, XP 7, 10, uh, 11 so all the uh, different different versions of the windows and in this video i'm going to show how you can run windows 10 the 64 bit and in this windows 10 the uh, internet is perfectly working and in this video i'm going to use this limbo pc emulator as you can see this is the different uh, type of limbo pc emulator let me just show you so as you can see so this is the uh limbo pc emulator but uh, developed by the different developer and they have some mods and different features so in this video i'm going to uh, show you how you can run windows uefi so let me just show you i have downloaded the windows file so as you can see this is the uh, windows 10 uh, 64 bit uefi as you can see in the screen to run this uh, type of windows uh, you have to use this limbo pc emulator it will not going to work on the official and uh, what we are using the normal version of the limbo pc emulator so you have to use this limbo pc emulator to run that windows 10 so let me just show you how you can do that the ios as I already said, this is the different type of limbo as you can see in the screen. The interface as you can see, this is the totally different interface and the icons and the colors. So this is the totally different. So now I'm going to show you how you can run the windows. As you can see, this is the windows 64-bit uh, UEFI version in your Android. To run that windows in your Android, you have to download and install this version of the limbo PC emulator. If you are using that basic version, you have to uninstall that uh, limbo PC emulator and you have to install this limbo pc emulator you can also use this this is the very uh, good version uh, there are a lot of features as you can see in the screen uh, there are a lot of features and the interface look very good and as you can see this is the all the uh, things uh, you get in the limbo pc emulator so you have to uninstall that uh, basic version and you have to download and install this version i have provided the link in the description and second thing you have to download the windows 10 64 bit uefi file the downloading in the description after downloading you have to extract it as you can see it will get about six uh, 4.5 uh, gb approx 6 gb make sure you have enough storage in your android phone and as you can see this is the uefi.vsd file you have to keep in the android internal storage so before uh, opening limbo pc emulator make sure to connect with the internet because as i mentioned earlier this windows 10 is going to support window uh, internet so now i am going to open the limbo pc emulator application now you have to click on the none as so i as you can see in the screen i have already created a 10 machine so let me just show you all the settings what i have done in this limbo uh, pc emulator application so as you can see i have machine already created with the 10 now you have to scroll down you have to skip the user interface but as you can see there are a lot of features over here in this limbo pc emulator application now you have to get into the cpu board you have to select architecture 64 as i mentioned earlier this is the 64 bit of the windows 10 and you have to select the cpu sandy bridge you can select uh, as you can depend upon you what cpu you want to select cpu course i have selected 4 and ram i have selected to 2000 mb like uh, 2 gb of ram enough for the windows 10 to run and you have to make sure to enable mttcg as you can see this is the all the settings you have to do in the cpu and board now you have to get into the disk you have to enable the disk a you have to click on the open and you have to open the windows 10 that file you have as i already said to download the downloading in the description you have to open that file in the disk now you have to scroll down you have to get into the network and you have to click on the user and you have to select network card rtl 8139 as you can see this is the network card you have to select to enable internet in the windows 10. you have to scroll down you have to get into the disk high priority advanced you have to get into the advanced you have to click on the high priority so and again you have to click on the more and you have to click on the uefi so at first it will uncheck you have to click on the check uh, now uh, the uefi has been working you have to check, check on it and as you can see i've done all the settings so let me just uh, turn on this notification turn my android phone to get the better view for the better understanding 
turn on my uh, screen rotation and turn my android phone as you can see i have done all the settings in the limbo pc emulator the reason why i have turned my android phone so you can get the better view for the full screen and you can understand better so i have done all the settings after doing all the settings uh, you have to click on the play button so as you can see in the screen it will saying starting vm and the windows 10 has been started booting up here so here you have to wait until the windows 10 has been booted successfully When finally the windows 10 64 bit has been successfully put at uh, in my android phone as you can see in the screen using this uh, uh, limbo pc emulator application and as you can see this is the all the features of the limbo this is how you can enable the keyboard uh, this is the you can change the mosque and you can change the uh, screen refresh rate as you can see from here and as you can see this is the windows 10 fully working and and as you can see in the screen this is the time and date has been successfully synced with this windows 10 windows 10 and as you can see in the screen internet has been successfully connected with this windows 10 because we have already selected uh, the internet card the network card in the limbo settings so let me just so let me just open the properties of this pc So as you can see as I mentioned earlier this is the Windows 10 64 bit and this uh, Windows is only, only going to work in this Limbo PC emulator application it will not going to work uh, with the another application. This is the uh, about the PC and we have select the sandy bridge and will showing up the Intel Xeon uh, E312 processor which is on the 4 gigahertz 1.00 gigahertz with the four cores and the 2 gb of ram so this is the all the details so it will be in the russian language but you can change the language so soon uh, the video will coming on my youtube channel that how you can change the language in, in any windows so there are some windows uh, versions on my youtube channel like windows 10 8 they are in the russian language but uh, you can change the language to english language um, there is a procedure you can change while downloading so it's a process to change the language soon i'm going to show you and i'm going to make a video on it too. so make sure to subscribe to my youtube channel for that upcoming video and as you can see this is the fully working windows 10 i have shown the pc properties and have uh, shown you the internet driver is connected over here and uh, you can also install the PC software. So let me just open the PC uh, file manager to show you how much uh, hard drive it's having to install uh, softwares. It had al already having some preloaded software like Visual, uh, Win 10 Tweaker activation. So these are some uh, uh, softwares which have developer added in this Windows 10. So as you can see in the screen, this is the uh, file manager on my computer to show you the disk I just now have open so as you can see in the screen this is the uh, disk it's having about uh, as you can see in the screen a lot of storage it's will having carrying and you can install a lot of uh, softwares in that so to how you can install software I am also going to make a video on it so if you want that video let me know in the comments so i have already made a video on how you can install softwares in windows xp and windows vista 
so the upcoming video will be windows 7 then 8 then 10 then 11 so there are a lot of upcoming videos on my youtube channel that i'm going to show how you can turn your android phone into fully a working pc so there are a lot of people in this world who can't afford pc so that's why i'm helping those people to work there are some softwares and features that are only going to work in the uh pc so that's why i'm showing and helping them so i'm also showing how uh, you can install any pc software in android with using the another uh, emulator so there are a lot of videos on my youtube channel you can check out windows 10 64 bit fully working in limbo pc emulator and this is the another version of the windows uh, and this is the another type of uh, limbo pc emulator i am using so that's it for this video thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel like this video share this video if you have a question or problem let me know in the comments thank you